Okay, everyone, this is how you put Folder Lock onto your UMD, so now I can get into your private stuff. Okay, first of all, go to the download link, and I'll show you what on here. Go to newsoftware.net. And then this should come back up. Now what you do is you scroll down the page and click free download. Okay, now you save it obviously. And then you save. And now I'll show you what to do after that. Okay, once you've downloaded it, this should pop up on the screen. Now what you do is you open it. Now you pick your language. Obviously English. And you go through the steps. Now because you want it on your um because you want it on your U U USB, you plug in the USB. Which you can't see properly because it isn't very light. So I'll do that. Unplug it, and you put in the USB. Now, you click the browse button, and you pick which is USB, that's my USB. Click that and you go OK. Then you go Next. Obviously, follow lock 6. And then you install it. Okay, then I'll skip past this bit for you. Now on your U... Um, I keep forgetting the name of them. Whatever. On your USB, that's it. You should have a, f a folder called Folder Lock 6. Now what you do is you click on that. And you click on that little icon right there. And you open that up. It's going to take a little bit, I'll pause it for you. Okay, now this will pop up. You don't want to buy the full version, so you go later. Click there. Now you create a new locker if you don't have one. But I already have one, so I go open existing locker. Now you're going to enter your password. There we go. Click OK. And you open up your folder. And there you go. If you don't want it there, pretty sure you just click and drag, and then it'll in um, save it onto the desktop for you. Okay then, thanks for watching. Oh yeah, I've got to tell you this. Keep the install off because it m might say that I won't be allowed to have it anymore because you can only have it for a certain amount of time because it's free. So keep the install off and don't worry, you won't lose any of your data. Okay, thanks for watching.